What is going on guys? It is Joe and welcome to a brand new episode of The Breakfast Club. For those that are new to the channel, The Breakfast Club is basically a mini Q&A where I answer one or two questions that I leave down in the comments below or message me on Instagram in the DMs at Joseph underscore Garcia 17. We do that all while eating breakfast and we call that The Breakfast Club. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Please hit that subscribe button and that like button for more videos I post every day. For breakfast this morning, we have your five slices of French toast, one serving of Oiko's Greek yogurt, 200 grams of strawberries, one serving of blueberries, and 11 grams of powdered peanut butter. So here's quite the hefty breakfast. Looks absolutely amazing if I do say so myself. For those that follow me based on my prep series, ladies and gentlemen, we hit a new low weigh-in today of 160.2 pounds. I'm good and we're 12 days out from our very first show. Before we get into it, let's go ahead and give this French toast a little bit of a taste test. We got some French toast, we have some blueberries, we have some strawberries, all right here. Mmm. Also a morning cup of Joe. Damn, this is good. Five minutes later. Well, that isn't the first time I finished something uh, prematurely. So our question today comes from Javier De La Rosa. I have a question for the next Breakfast Club video. I heard cardio kills gains. Is this true? I weight lift and love playing basketball as well. I could play for hours. However, I know basketball is an intense sport. I don't want to get in the way of me building muscle. However, I can't just give up the sport I love to play. What should I do? For the question, Javier, you know what's funny is I've actually gotten a lot of questions in regards to cardio and it quote unquote killing gains. Now, a lot of people seem to be worried that cardio is going to be the thief of the night that actually steals their gains. In a sense, yeah, cardio can kill your gains, but cardio can also be beneficial for your gains. Weightlifting and cardio need to be looked at like two separate things. Cardio specifically trying to burn fat and burn calories. Weightlifting trying to build muscle or build strength depending on your goals. So really cardio isn't really necessarily the direct factor that's actually killing your gains. It's, it's the fact that you're in too big of a caloric deficit that would kill your gains. And if cardio is the reason why your calorie deficit is so large, then either A, you need to tone back the cardio or B, eat enough calories to the point where you're not basically breaking down muscle tissue for energy. If cardio or playing sports was the reason why you can't build muscle, the reason why it's stealing your gains, it's not to say the cardio that's killing your gains, it's the fact that the cardio is creating too big of a calorie deficit where you're not able to really build any more muscle. If the notion was true that cardio does kill your gains, and even playing a sport would prevent you from building muscle. I've never been able to build muscle as a soccer player. Soccer is one of the most cardio-based, endurance-based sports in the world. My best gains I made was actually when I was in season playing soccer, doing a shit ton of cardio. Just so I started making gains as a soccer player and that much cardio is when I actually just started eating more. In a sense, kind of main gaining when I was a soccer player. I mean, I floated as a soccer player like around 165 pounds and I kind of maintained that all of my junior and senior year. Throughout my junior and senior year, I was still building muscle and breaking down fat. Just overall main gaining. Before that, when I started working out, I was still playing soccer and I made some of the best gains in that time period of doing both at the same time. Now, when I say that playing basketball and doing an extensive amount of cardio is the most ideal for building muscle and, and let's say being a bodybuilder, no, I wouldn't recommend that. No, in that case, the basketball might hinder you from maximizing muscle tissue, but you can still make gains and play basketball at the same time. Now, if your goal is to be healthy and to be able to do cardio that you enjoy and you want to just make gains in the gym, then yes, do basketball and do weight training. You don't have to separate the two or stop playing basketball to try and make gains. If your goal is to step on stage and be a competitor and want to maximize the amount of muscle tissue that your frame can carry, then you might have to ease up on playing basketball, especially during the season to try and just maximize your muscle growth. If your goal is just to be a healthier individual and you love playing basketball, I would never tell you to stop doing the cardio that you love, simply at the expense of making gains in the gym when you can very much do both. When it comes to making gains and when it comes to doing cardio, do the cardio that you love. You can simultaneously make gains in the gym and play sports. You get to the point where you feel like you're not making any strength gains, you have no energy, you can't build muscle. And then saying even like stop playing basketball or play less, I would just say eat more food or eat more calories to compensate that calorie deficit that's preventing you from building more muscle and gaining more strength in the gym. I hope that answered your question, Javier. I hope it gave you a little more peace of mind when it comes to you trying to make gains in the gym and also playing basketball. 
Please, please, please do the cardio that you enjoy. Cardio is super important for your heart. 150 minutes of moderate intensity cardio per week is what you want to strive for to have a healthy heart. The only thing I'm wrapping up today is this entire video, guys. Make sure you leave a like. Over cardio and strength training at the same time, I know it can be a little bit overwhelming. So make sure to leave any questions in the comments down below. I do pretty much a breakfast mini Q&A every other day outside of my vlog uploads. I'm wrapping the video up here, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. It's been your boy, Joe. Peace.